Good afternoon to all of my lovely divas and welcome back to my channel. This is Lady, Lady Diva and I'm here because it is Monday and not only is it my wash day, but it's Motivational Monday. Woo! And I'm here today with a special message for all of my subbies. And I want to say, first of all, thank you to all of my subscribers. I have gained quite a few subscribers in the last few days. And I want to say thank you to each and every one of you guys. I love you guys. Please comment on the videos. I take um, all of your suggestions and words of encouragement and support so seriously. And it really means a lot to me. So always, you know, comment and just thank you so much for what you're doing and being a blessing to me as I try to be a blessing to you. So we are back here for Motivational Monday. And I'm in my happy orange because today is happy orange day for me. And, um, you know, um, I'm just today's a good day. Every day is a good day that you wake up and you're breathing and you're able to see your family and your friends. Every day is a good day, which leads me right into my subject for today, which is stay positive. Motivational Monday today is stay positive. No matter what anybody else is doing, no matter what anybody else is saying, no matter what anybody else is thinking about, you stay positive no matter what. And me, um, just in general, I'm a positive person. I am a happy person. I love to smile better than I love to frown. And if those those who don't know, it takes more muscles in your face to frown than it does to smile. And I'm a smiler. I'm a hugger. I'm an encourager. I'm a motivator. I'm an inspirator. That's just who I am by nature. That is who God has made me to be. And I love to be around positive um, people, happy people, people who see the glass half full instead of half empty. And I am just want to encourage all of my subbies and everyone who listens to this today, you know, stay positive. Yes, things may not be looking all that great. Yeah, you may only have two nickels to run, rub together. You may not have any food in your um, cupboards. You know, your car may be broken down. You might not have a job. But on all of that, you are alive. You are breathing. God has given you another chance, another opportunity for something great to happen in your life. The Bible does say weeping may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning. And half of your battle in staying positive is your attitude. If you stay positive in your attitude, if you have an attitude of gratitude, as I say, then great things are going to happen for you. Um, the Bible also says life and death are in the power of your tongue. What you speak is what you give life to. What you speak is what you are going to produce fruit of. What you speak is what is going to come forth out of your life, out of your spirit, out of your mind, out of your mind, you all. And so that's one thing I love to do is I speak positive. You know, everything's always peaches and cream. There's some pits in the cherry bowl sometime, you all, but I always see the good in everything because it keeps me motivated to continue on. It keeps me motivated to do more. It keeps me motivated to stay focused on what my ultimate goal and purpose and destiny is. It's not just here at where you are today. This is going to pass. You know, this too shall pass. There's going to be a brighter day and a brighter tomorrow. Trouble doesn't last always. And when you have that type of mindset, you know, that things are going to get better. Things are going to turn around. The, the dark cloud always has a silver lining. There is light at the end of every tunnel. Come on now. Then you will stay positive in everything that you say or do. You'll find yourself smiling when you want to be crying. You'll find yourself laughing when you want to be moaning and groaning. And that's just wonderful. And another thing that I want to say about staying positive, it gives you a nice energy level. People want to be around positive people. Don't nobody want to be around somebody who's always negative and murmuring and complaining. I'm just being real about it. I'd rather be around positive, smiling, happy, joyful, glorious, exuberant people than somebody who's always got something negative to say and something negative to complain about. Don't nobody want to be around nobody like that. And I will tell somebody, oh, you are raining on my parade and you trying to tarnish my shine. So I got to get away from you. Surround yourself around positive people, because believe it or not, that energy that you give off is positive. helps somebody else stay uplifted. It helps somebody else stay positive. It helps somebody else to smile. It helps somebody else to see a different perspective of life, because there are so many others that are worse off than you. Think about it. Think about it. Think about members of your family. Think about th people in third world countries that are so much worse off than we are. And so with that, you know, knowing that I'm fearfully and wonderfully made, knowing that God has his hand on my life, knowing that great and marvelous things are going to happen. I can't help but be happy and be positive. And I'm just want to um, convey that message to you all today. Um, you know, one of my children received a great report today, which has sent me over the moon. Staying positive will bring forth positive results, you all. I'm a living 
breathing proof. Staying positive brings forth positive results. Negativity will breed negativity. And another thing, people who bring, they tired. They drain my spirit. They drain your energy. They just drain you because negativity drains you. It saps your strength when you are negative. And don't nobody got time to have no strength being sapped for being negative. We have to use all of our energy and we need to use all of our strength to continue to progress forward and move on and reach and attain the goals that we have set for our lives and most of all what God has purposed us for. So this was a good one. I'm excited at, you know, about this because this is who I am by nature. I don't change for nobody. You know, I can change a room and so can you. You can change the very atmosphere of where you are in a room by being positive. You can uplift anything heavy by being positive, by speaking a word of encouragement, by giving somebody a hug or a smile. You don't know what that does for somebody else's psyche when you give them something positive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to challenge you all today. Stay positive for seven days. No murmuring, no complaining, no negativity. Don't be around negative people. Don't read anything negative. Don't say anything negative and watch what happens. I guarantee you, your, your perception itself will be better. You'll find yourself smiling for more. You'll sp find yourself laughing more and you'll find stress relieved off of you. When you stay positive, honey, stress can't stay. Stress can't stay. So anyways, this is Lady Diva I'm coming to you again with the Motivational Monday. Be positive, stay positive, live positive. It's so much more out there than letting something negative tear you down. Okay, divas, I love you all. And remember, don't let anybody tarnish your shine and certainly don't let them rain on your parade. I love you. If you want to keep in touch with me so I can keep in touch with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave comments below for any other topics you want me to bring up on Motivational Mondays. I'll be happy to do it. I love you all. Be blessed. Stay positive. Bye-bye.